Hello everyone, welcome to my first ever Disney Pixar Cars review. Today on the table we have Strip Weathers, aka The King. Here we have the back of the package with some of the other characters that are available, and as you can see, it is made in Thailand. We have the metal logo right there because this is a fully metal die cast. Now enough talk, let's go ahead and get him out of the package. Alright, now that we have him out of the package, we can get a closer look at him. And as many of you know, he is uh, based on and played by Richard Petty, the number 43 real-life NASCAR driver, also called The King. With many of the new Thailand variants of these cars, they no longer have silver wheels. This is also true for The King. He has a gray bumper and gray wheels instead, which isn't too much of a difference, but I always did like the silver details, but I can make do with this. Another thing I would like to point out about this diecast is that the eyelids, since they're now a separate piece, it is not the exact same color as the rest of the body, but once again, that's not too big of a deal. From far away, you can't really tell the difference. And obviously, the big spoiler on the back here is a separate plastic piece. Now, this kind of surprised me when I noticed it, but there is a little line of white paint there to make it seem like he has teeth. That's quite the attention to detail from Mattel there. I'm quite surprised that they even did that. Another thing about these Thailand variants is that the uh, decals here are a little bit blurry compared to how they used to be, but like I said, like most things with this diecast, uh, from far away you can't really tell a difference. And uh, yeah, his main sponsor is Dynaco, and he has all his contingency sponsors on the side right there. One cool little detail about this uh, diecast is that the eyes are actually raised up a little bit. You can't really see it on camera, but you can definitely feel it. This is a 155 scale diecast made by Mattel with no paper stickers. Alright everyone, so that is the end of this video. Stay tuned for an upcoming Lightning McQueen review, and please don't forget to leave a Mondo like and I will catch you guys in the next one. Goodbye.